Hello. We are over halfway through with summer reading, and today we are going to be making our um, spoon puppets, our wooden spoon puppets. And in the example, I made Goldilocks and the Three Bears. So in today's tutorial, I thought we would make um, the Big Bad Wolf and the Three Little Pigs. So um, there are a couple ways you can do this. You can use paint and you can also use um, markers. So um, I'm going to use markers today um, just to cut down on some mess and to save some time. But feel free to use paint. Um, when I did Goldilocks and the Three Bears, I did um, acrylic paint. Um, and that seemed to work out fairly well. Goldilocks. Um, so summer reading is still on, still going on. Um, you can um, still submit your bingo sheets. You can email them to us. You can drop them in the book drop. You can send us a message on Facebook. There's a couple of different ways you can tell us you're, you've finished. You can pick up new bingo sheets at the green pick up, pick up picnic table where we're doing curbside pickup. And if you do any of these crafts, be sure to send us pictures of them. When you do pictures, um, when you send in pictures of your crafts, you get entered to win more prizes for summer reading. So make sure that you're sending in your pictures. So let's get started with our wolf. I'm going to start with the wolf. And so I'm going to use some gray, gray markers. Um, I have a gray here, but maybe like a black outline. Maybe I'll use a thin black marker. Um, what color eyes do you think a wolf has? Maybe blue. Like a real blue. Blue. Um, maybe like a little black nose. But I need to make him look, he's scary, right? The, the wolf is scary because he huffs and he puffs and he blows their house down, you know? So, you got to give him some pointy ears here. I'll try to back up so you can sort of see what I'm doing here. But you're just going to make your wolf. And I'm terrible at this. Um, so, just feel free to sort of... He's got these teeth, so I'm going to really focus on his teeth here. And he's got this, these eyes, he's got these kind of mean eyes. I think, I think wolves have whiskers, I don't know. So there's my kind of basic outline of a, of a wolf. And I'm going to go in and add some details with my bigger markers. This is my... Give him some shaggier fur here around his... Really could sort of fill him out here. grouchy. And he probably has 
this red tongue inside of his mouth, doesn't he? He's probably panting like a little dog would at the sight of those three little pigs. these eyes. He has, well, oh, his eyes don't look very blue. I tried to use blue, but it kind of doesn't look blue. But here's my big bad wolf. So here's the wolf. And now we're going to draw some pigs. So I'm going to do use some pinks, some real pale pinks, maybe even some like I have all these different color Sharpie markers, so um, but I think you can, you can really use any markers that you have. They don't have to be Sharpie markers. So I'm going to start with one little pig. I don't really know what kind of ears pigs have. Maybe they're more pointy than that. And maybe this pig has brown eyes. He's going to have brown eyes. And he's going to have a bow tie. I've decided he's going to have a blue bow tie because he's, he's kind of snappy like that. He's a snappy dresser. So there's little pig number one. And little pig number two. Oh yeah, I think their ears are more pointed. And I think she's going to have blue eyes. She'll have blue eyes. And, oh, maybe I'll give her some eyelashes. You know, that's how we know she's a girl. And, oh, maybe we'll give her a little curl on the top of her head. So we have the snappy bow tie and a little curl. And our last little pig. some hair too. He'll have a little, like maybe some red hair. Two little sprigs. Um, so we've got some pigs here. And our big, big bad wolf. And so our big bad wolf can say, I'm gonna huff and I'm gonna puff. And I'm going to blow your house down. Um, and so, of course, you can paint. You can use markers. You can do whatever you want. Um, you can do the three little pigs and the wolf. You, you can do Goldilocks and the three little bears. Or the three bears. Um, with the Goldilocks, um, I just sort of did her face. My daughter thought that was hilarious. Um, 
And then I did Papa Bear. He's sort of biggest. Mama Bear. You're a baby bear. Um, so, um, you can keep your designs really simple. Um, and, um, cartoonish. Um, and go in and just have fun with it. And when you're finished, make sure you send us a photo of it. You can send it to us in an email. You can email it to me at alfred at stls.org. Um, you can send it to us on Facebook, Facebook Messenger. Um, um, those are the two main ways. Um, and you'll be entered to win some really great summer reading prizes. So um, if you want more great ways to win, be sure to send us some photos. And we've been seeing some great photos lately. So for more chances to win, send us some photos. Bye.